Hello viewers, welcome back. This video is the updated version of how to detect if your PC has been hacked or not for Windows 10. Before I begin, you should understand that this is just a quick method to identify any suspicious connection to your PC. And the method is for usually advanced users. But I'm sure everyone can understand and identify if you follow this step and understand the concept of this video. But this does not uh, mean that you will identify uh, if you are hacked or not. It's just a quick guideline. It's just to give you a quick understanding uh, if you are connected to some PC without your permission. So let's begin. Uh, let's open up a command prompt and then type netstate slash ANO. Uh, so here I have a couple of IPs connected to each other. The PID stands for Process Identifier and state means uh, the status of the connectivity from local address to foreign address. So let's check out uh, uh, some of these connections. Uh, if you can see, I have a different connection established here. All of these connections are identified by myself. Uh, I just want to uh, tell you the concept of the video. Right here, if you can see, there are uh, these three IPs connected to 6012. Let's check this, uh, this one. Go to uh, Taskbar, right click and Task Manager. Here you can, you should uh, right click here and then select PID. See, now I have all these uh, PID which I can identify to this command line. Let's check this one, 6012. 6012 is connected to what? 6012 is connected to Google Chrome. Uh, obviously, I have Google Chrome running right here. See, so what I want to do is uh, close Google Chrome. So exit. Now Google Chrome, Chrome is closed. Let's check again. Next state slash eno. So, if you can see that uh, there is no 6012 anymore because I have disconnected Google Chrome to the foreign address. So, what I'm trying to tell you here if your computer is connected to, uh, let's suppose, some ID and you check here and you are not satisfied or you're not sure what it is. You can then uh, investigate further to see if this is uh, uh, maybe malware, adware, spyware, or could be anything. And also, you can right-click here and check the publisher. It this would this could also tell you if you should uh, trust this connection or not. Like this one, a TechSmith Corporation, it's connected, and many other uh, services that are running to the very known uh, publishers, Google Inc. and many other stuff. You can also check uh, the process name to identify which exe file is running here. If you can see there are a couple of exe files running here. And uh, this, this, um, uh, these are the, some methods that you can uh, check and uh, identify if this is a, something I should believe, I should trust or something very suspicious could be anything so you should then investigate further uh, whether this connection should be made or not so this is the way I've already created a window for Windows XP before so Windows XP is now legend history so this is a Windows 10 edition and I'm pretty sure that you can uh, follow this easy step to identify if uh, you are somehow connected to uh, for an IP address which you do not trust. So thank you very much for watching this video. I hope you understand. If you have any question, please comment and do ask me. Thank you very much.